I watched the Christmas special, and the show that I've been literally in a relationship with for the last 50 years burned as brightly as it's ever burned before. And then it died. And I went and I put out the candle in front of the Doctor Who shrine, because what else can you do? And then I realised there was something else I could do. Well, the great thing about a charity single is you're not just raising money, you're raising awareness. And what are you trying to raise awareness of? Awareness that Doctor has been a constant in our lives for the last 50 years, and the BBC are prepared to sacrifice that and risk cancellation for the sake of so-called progressive identitarianism and a virtue signaling agenda. He has lived to over a thousand And he came from outer space and every three or four years He can change his entire face He's been northern, Scottish and Cockney Can be frail or full of agility But, but if you say he can change his sex You're stretching credibility Doctor in a dress Rescue him from this please I up quite a number of Doctor Who celebrities and fans. I was a Nymon in Seasons of Fear. I nearly played a Cyberman in Dimensions in Time. And Gary Barlow, but he'll do anything if you pay in cash. Why does the TARDIS look like a police box? A chameleon circuit fail. The Doctor has a man's face. That's because he is a male. There was always room for women, like the Leelas and the Victorias. But if you let them have their way, they'll fill the TARDIS full of bras. Doctor. Do you have any doctors? Well, uh, we've cut in some footage of Sylvester McCoy playing the spoons and we've used the animated Tom Baker which I created for an unofficial extended version of Terror of the Zygons a few years ago so actually there's real credibility the princess, doctor in a dress Rescue him from this PC mess Doctor in a dress He's a doctor not a nurse and he's not a princess so please do buy the MP3. That's Doctor in a Dress by Who Knows. That's the name of the band, by the way. I, I do know who did it. It was us. Don't forget to use the hashtag NotMyDoctorInAddress. All the money raised will go to a charity supporting white men, the most persecuted minority in the UK. You know that nurses can be men. Yeah, well, I'm not against male nurses, just female doctors. Doctors can be female as well. <laughs> yeah, you're telling me. Well, that's the 21st century all over, isn't it? Yeah. Shouldn't Doctor Who be relevant for the 21st no, century? Look, no, you don't get it, do you? He's, he's got a time machine, so he doesn't need to belong to the 21st century. He can visit the 21st century without being ensnared by it. That's the whole point of Doctor Who. Thank you very much for your time. Piss off, I've got the words. Ruff, girl.